Double sock. Double sock. Double sock. Oh Double sock. Oh my god. I don't know me went double saw. This is even sweaty. This is even sweater. So you have like cushions on cushions. Yeah. Could go barefoot. Could I do? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm serious. You could. Well, actually, you can. Give me a I could have told two teams. Yeah, you can't do heel and toe on this. It doesn't work. Okay. Man. Move, move. That, was, that was a little bit of a problem, yeah. Just to help you out. Move, move, move. Man, brackets are just, they're just too good. I'm bad at them. Why are you using these staircases? Oh, I'm a huge bracket fan. Yeah, big feet. It'll be easier for you. <laughs> I actually, I, I, I remember like when I was doing the 14s and I was like, what the frick is this? And then I accidentally did it. And then I was like, okay. Yep. When you do brackets, do you use your bottom foot to hit holes? Yeah, you, you kind of like, you kind of like, you go like, like you kind of like, like use your whole foot for both of the things and then you hit the other one. It's kind of how you do it. Big feet help. If you have big feet, then apparently I do have big feet. So if if you got big feet, you can you can hit brackets and Easier. start an only So <laughs> and cheat side brackets. Yeah, yeah. Red and blues. Wow, we just we just skipped over what I just said. There. <laughs> <laughs> How do you cheat a bracket? You can't cheat a bracket. You just have big feet. Well, having big feet is technically cheating. The only way to hit a bracket is to hit. You can't heal and toe. You can cheat brackets, but you can cheat patterns by bracketing by delaying them. So you can like, if there's a one, like three, four, you can cheat that. Like, like 